Right, got it. You need a bit more bacon. No, you gotta eat your food first. What you eat? What you got? Some watermelon. Mm -hmm. um, banana. Let me see. Some ah, can I get it? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Can I get it, please? Why are you eat like that? Oh my god! <laughs> I like the melons. Eat. Thank you for snacking, though. So, can you guys see my head? There's something I want us to talk about. Yeah, I know, like, maybe I need to see what that is. This. Can I sit next to you? Yeah. Oh, sorry. Okay. Nikki, stick your feet on me. Sit up straight, Nikki. Hold on, let me turn some of this light on and see if it's going to make any difference. Let's try this one. Is it better now? Mm -hmm. uh. Mm -hmm. Down, turn on. Hi. Ah, I hit my elbow. So, there's something I want us to talk about. Talk yeah, about no. What? Mm. You're just here because you're the princess of the house, and there's no way I can talk. Or we can sit like this without you being right here, right? That's freezing. But uh, where your foot? Here. But uh, what I want us to talk about, you know how like it's been it's been two years, okay? And sometimes yeah, I will ask me some questions about um daddy, and I'll just be like, uh, you know what I mean? Mm -hmm. So, how do you all feel for the two years? And yeah, always. One of oh yeah, I always say like mm -hmm. he that like daddy left right. Mm -hmm. <laughs> so how did y'all feel about that, and the fact that sometimes we really don't talk about that? How did y'all feel? Let me use let me use it in y'all's own word. Like he left, like daddy left, right? Mm -hmm. Then I'm gonna talk after y'all talk and tell y'all something. How how did y'all feel? Or how do y'all feel? Who wanna go first? Mm -hmm. You don't mind, who go first? I'm gonna guess with me. Nah? Yeah, you can go first, Akon. Since you're the oldest, <coughs> you can go first. Well, I, when I saw when he left, I didn't feel happy. Mm -hmm. I felt sad and, like, this kind of way, I felt sad and wished that daddy can come back. And I thought that if he didn't come back, then I, um, then I wouldn't have a dad no more, and then I would be sad. Okay, all right. Nikki, how about you? Um, no, how did you feel? Mama, stop, eat your food. I felt sad. Okay. So, I, I want you to talk, like, talk how you felt, okay? Like, just how you felt. Don't don't look at me, okay? Don't look at me like how I'm gonna feel. Just tell me like what was in your mind or what is in your mind, how you still feel. You know what I mean? Then we're gonna really talk about it. I feel like I've not really sat down, really talked to you about it because I felt like yeah, we were too young. I didn't wanna like you know what I mean? But I feel like as yeah I get older and I realize like the yeah's level of thinking is like this high. Some of the questions that you asked me and stuff like that. So I just feel like it's time for us to talk about it. Okay? Mm -hmm. So, how about to you, Nikki? Mm -hmm. How about to you? That's all you felt sad? No, I felt sad and I wish you can come back. Okay, so can we talk about that now? Same thing. It, can we talk about it? It's okay. It's normal for you to feel the way you feel or the way you felt. Okay? But the truth is, I don't want, I don't want, I'm talking, I'm not including sad because she's just a little baby. I don't want Ekong and Niki to feel sad in their heart like, hey, like, daddy left. I don't want y'all to look at it like he left. He's still in y'all's life, right? Mm -hmm. Y'all spend time with him, right? Y'all yeah. go there and spend like, you can spend like a whole month. Last summer, y'all spent three months, right? So he's still in your life, right? He didn't leave. Just like, let's say for example, 
you know how you and Ekon, can you count, can you recount like how many times you are getting to eat over toys, over some little things, over little games, like you got your own computer, you got your own computer, right? And you still fight over little games, right? So, you and Ninky are from like the same mommy, the same daddy, right? Okay, let's look at it this way. Look at it where I got my own daddy, I got my own mommy, right? And your daddy got his own mommy, got his own daddy, right? Mm -hmm. So both of us were raised like two different, like from two, by two different parents, right? And from two different environments, right? Yeah. So can you imagine like putting two people together who were raised completely different? Can you imagine putting the two of them to live in the same house oh. and they don't understand each other? Huh? So there's bound to be like conflict sometimes, right? Just like I said, yeah, fight over uh, little toys and stuff like that. So it's very common for two people like that to get into arguments, but it, de it depends. Thank you. It depends on how they handle their conflict, right? So, I don't want you to look at it like, hey, daddy left us. No, he didn't leave. Sometimes when two grown-ups cannot like agree on something, in order for peace to reign, if they cannot, like, they just cannot agree on something. You know what I mean? In the force at each other. Sometimes for peace to reign, one person has to like just walk away. In that person walking away or like, daddy had to go, okay? Let me not put it. I don't want to use the word go or left. Not because he does not care about you. Don't look at it like he left. Okay? I don't want you to feel that way like grown up and feel like hey daddy left us. No, he did not leave. He's still around. He still comes around to see you. He still come and pick you and take you out, right? Mm -hmm. So I don't want you to ever grow up and feel that lacking like like daddy walked away or daddy left. No, he did not leave. You know what I mean? Mm -hmm. There are times when God can put two people together for a purpose. And once that purpose is fulfilled, there's nothing that that person can do about it and there's nothing that the other person can do about it. Okay? It is just meant to happen that way. If God did not want it to happen that way, it will not happen that way. Do you get it? So there are certain things in life that are designed to happen a certain way. No, if why you mash the avocado like that? So do you understand me? Mm -hmm. So does that make any sense now that daddy did not leave? He's still with you, even though he's not living in the same house. But he still spend time with you, he still come get you. So he's still part of your life. Mm -hmm. You know what I mean? There are some parents that will walk away. I hate to, I don't want to use the word walk away. There are some parents that will, that will go like that and live their life and will be like part of their kid's life. But he's still in your life, right? Wait, you still do stuff I see that right? on Nikki's head. Okay, so that's how I want you to see him. Like he's still in Yao's life. You see that? Okay, does that make sense? See what? Yeah, okay. So I just wanted us to talk mama. about that. And you, Ekon, and Nikki feeling sad. It's okay. It's all right to feel sad. Don't touch it, please. You hyper. So, do you understand now that it's okay for you to feel sad like, okay, you've been living in the same house with your dad, you see him every morning, every afternoon, every evening, then he just, all of a sudden you can't see him no more. But, it's like he comes around. So, I want you, I don't want you to grow up and feel like, like daddy left. Because he did not leave. Even though he's not in the same house with you, but you are still spend some good quality time with him, right? He still play around with you. He still do some stuff with you, right? Mm -hmm. So, yeah, you to contribute. So, I don't want. I just felt like this is something that we need to talk about more. So, yeah, don't feel, don't feel sad. Don't feel that emptiness. Understand like there are certain things in life that are beyond our control as human beings, right? Mm -hmm. So, did that give space for like, okay? You know how some I've watched cases where some no I've watched cases where some kids grow up and they feel this sadness in their heart, this emptiness in their heart, feeling like their daddy walked away from their life. So now they are sad, they worry, they they grow up to be like men and they're not happy because they feel like their daddy left when they were little. Have you ever watched stuff like that? I've watched stuff like that on TV, right? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. 
Yeah, right? Mm -hmm. So, I don't want y'all to grow up and feel that way because he's still part of y'all's life, right? So, did that answer y'all's question? Does that make any I sense? Bacon, did that? You don't need no bacon. You only had two slices. Eat your egg and your banana. You ate your avocado, you ate your um, watermelon. So, did that kind of like help a little? What do y'all think? Mm, yeah. I want, I want us to talk more, you know what I mean? I know y'all been asking questions for too long now, so I just wanted to use this medium to answer like, it's okay, it's all right. I have to feel, it's okay, it's all right for, when you get your eyes closed, it's yeah, okay, yeah. it's all right for y'all to feel that way. You know what I mean? But y'all are like kids, you know what I mean? Mm -hmm. And kids cannot, can never carry the burden of like grown up mistakes in your heart. Do you understand? Huh? Mm -hmm. Don't focus on like mistakes that maybe mommy did or maybe daddy did. Don't put it in your heart and be be mad like, okay, because this person wasn't in your life. I'm playing my own role as a mother and doing what I'm supposed to do, right? Yeah. And even though daddy is in existence, he's still playing his own role like a dad in y'all's life, right? Mm -hmm. It's not like he just, like he's gone, like y'all yeah, have gone for like three years, two years, haven't seen you dad, right? Um, you I spend time with candy. him. You want candy? What kind of candy you want this early morning? So does that make any sense? Mm -hmm. So do like this, take a deep breath. Out. Come on, Nikki, take a deep breath. Daddy. In. Out. Mom, Daddy, so how does that feel? Candy. You don't get no candy. You get some kind of relief? That's it, Mom. Mom, Daddy took all my candy. It's okay. So, can we end right here today that we've talked about something? That's because candy is not good for you. We've talked about something <clears throat> that is meaningful and something that's going to help you as you grow up. Mm -hmm. And I also want to say, like, you two have been doing so good, like, so, so good. I know the beginning was kind of, like, rough and hard, but you two have done so good, and I'm so proud of both of you. Okay? Uh-huh. So, I love you, too. I love you. Hope you guys like it. Oh, my God. Hope you guys love this video. And please share this video if you like it. And this is for, like, a lot of a lot of like uh um, bye bye move now move your head like yeah. parents that are going through like separation or divorce or whatever it doesn't pay anything for you to like sit and want to talk like kind of like negative about the other person that left you know what i mean truth is truth you know what i mean there are a lot of things that can go wrong and stuff like that but try to get your kids like in the best frame of mind you know what i mean mm -hmm. like do the best that you can to keep your mind intact you know what i mean but I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye. Right, I can tell you. That's the stuff. I can get. Oh, I can't tell you.